All right, everybody, Neil has come back from the vet. Actually, he came back a little while ago. We just let him um, chill for a little bit before I decided to actually do the video about it. But the main thing is that um, he has a sinus infection, so he's got to have some medicine to be able to clear that up before the vet can really take a real good look at him. But he does have his non-release papers, so that's a possibility of him not being released but if that's the case then we can keep him and he'll be another star of the show but that's only because of his teeth that they're looking at so before they can really look at the teeth and do anything about them they have to wait for the um, sinus infection to go away which is going to be like a two week process of giving him his medicine but luckily you know me it's pretty easy for me to teach my squirrels to take their medicine it's just basically these little things, which is a um, combination of the, what is it? The rodent blocks with the vitamins and stuff like that with a little bit of peanut butter. And then the medic medicine is actually uh, mixed into it. So pretty easy. He'll take it relatively easy. And this is the one that does have it. I have a bigger one that doesn't. But as you can see, he's going to come over here and just go ahead and take it, run off with it, and then start eating it. So this way we know he's going to take his medicine every day without any problems and it's twice a day. So we're starting today, which is Friday. So not next Friday, but the Friday afterwards, he'll be able to be off his medicine. And then he'll probably be going into the vet again to uh, be put under. So that way they can look at his teeth and possibly remove them. We don't know the price of that. And it's going to, if it's like a hundred bucks or so, which I doubt. It's easy to cover, even a couple hundred is pretty cover, easy to cover, but if it's like over two, three hundred dollars, five hundred dollars, I don't know how much it's actually gonna be, but if it's definitely up in that price range, I'll let you guys know. And if you guys want to help out for that, you can. Um, but unless otherwise, I'm not gonna ask for donations until we know the actual price behind it. So if you would like to save up for it, go ahead and save up for it for whatever you guys want to do. And then um, when I give, <laughs> we stop, little boy, um, afterwards, then you guys can donate if you wish to. And if not, you just have a little savings later on. So that's a good way to think about it. Um, but yeah, so far, we're not entirely sure what's wrong with him. But what we can see is that his teeth is messed up. But we're hoping that his teeth can be easily just trimmed or cut or something. And his teeth will be able to come back naturally without any problems and we can release them because it's supposedly my girlfriend was saying the hole in the side of his face is kind of closing up so we'll find out in the near future about that one but as you can see he's still doing pretty good he was just kind of freaked out when i had to get him earlier but here's his actual meal that one doesn't have anything in it just more food so we know he's getting at least some nutrients with his teeth how they are as you can see he's kind of only eating with his bottom but usually when i give him stuff like that they usually do eat with their bottom but that should help you know get him a little bit more healthy so when the time comes will you stop little boy you're just so so wanting attention that's what he wants and then we got this one outside that wants attention too but will you, will you stop why are you biting me you brat 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 i got a squirrel I got a baby squirrel yes um <laughs> but i was continuing um you should have plenty of food and be able to be um, releasing it back into the wild if there's nothing wrong with them in the near future. But that's after the next vet visit, which is in, a, you know, probably a two to three weeks. And when that time comes, I'll give you another update for it and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, last one last thing is Rand's birthday is coming up in, I think, nine days. So if you guys want to go for that, I don't know what I'm going to do for it. I know I am going to make like a little cupcake for him. With like peanut butter and of uh, the same stuff that Neo's eating, so it's actually healthy for him instead of like horribly bad. But other than that, um, I don't know, maybe a live stream of them or something like that. I don't actually know. I I don't know what I should do for him, but definitely gonna try to do something for him. If you guys have suggestions, let me down or let me know down in the comments on what I could do. But like I said, I don't actually know. All right, now officially, I'll see you in the next video.